<laughs> we're here with Jay Val. Why are you shaking? Your camera's literally doing this. I'm sorry. And you're so nervous. I'm just a merch guy. <laughs> I always get nervous. That was terrible. Yeah. Oh that was terrible too. Slow motion. Yeah, awesome. Wait, I didn't even get it on camera. <laughs> to the King Travis clothing tent and we're here with Nico. What's up? My name's Nico. I uh, hang out with uh, Travis over here. I do the King Travis merch. Make sure you keep watching my boy Frank on his vlogs, all right? Nice. We are here with Duncan. Remember him from the other vlog? What's up? How's it going? Good to be back. Ooh, you guys are enjoying the vlogs. We are at the show. which is the longest running rock tour ever recorded. <laughs> Kevin's main focus is on getting children attending his shows to get active in their communities and to get out there and help make the world a better place. That's you guys. One incentive that I'm sure you guys have heard about is you bring three cans of food to the show and you get to skip the line. And that food goes to feed our children now, which helps provide food and, and other things to local children that are in need. Who else does that? Punk rock for a good cause. He also has the blood drive, and anyone who gives blood gets a chance to go to backstage and meet their favorite bands. Another fun thing he does is he lets all the parents in for free! On behalf of the city of Orlando, we would like to dedicate July 27th every year as annual Warp Tour and Kevin Lyman Day. Hey guys, I know we got a show to do, but uh, it's a flashback. I know a lot of parents get in free, so maybe my first time I was on stage was in 1991 here. Lollapalooza, anyone be at that show, 91? When we stood up to the racist here that were flipping off iced tea, and we dragged about 20 racist skinheads out of the crowd, but got rid of them for good. And uh, we keep trying to do things with the Warped Tour, but mostly we're trying to bring you fun, 
and having a great day together where we all can get along and take it back into the communities and build our world a better place. So thank you, Orlando, for always supporting the band work on myself. And I, this is how long I've been doing it. This is my daughter, Sierra. She was born 19 days before I started the tour in 1995. And my younger daughter, Sabrine, who now works on the tour, and we'll keep it going as long as they want to do it. So let's have a great time, and we the Kings will be able to sack it. <laughs>
comfortable right now. Um, what am I doing? Oh, hello, YouTube. Is this YouTube? Do you do YouTube videos? Awesome. Everyone should subscribe to this channel and unsubscribe from Defense. Yeah, I hate that guy. <laughs> no, go subscribe to him.
the next day after the concert I couldn't end the vlog last night because my camera battery died and I was too tired to wait for it to charge we didn't end up seeing Nodorok yesterday at the concert to give him his wrestling figure that we got him so I just gave it to j -Val at the We The Kings tent to give to him and I wrote a little note on the box that was from me and my friend Skylar to, to him so he knows who it was from and I got this uh, comment from Nodrock on my Instagram this morning well I don't know, it, it, was said, it says it was last night but I didn't read it until this morning he commented on my photo of me coming out being bisexual and he said good job dude it takes a lot of courage to come clean about anything props also thank you and Skyla for the Brock Lesnar Zorad 
So I'm glad you like it, No Rock, and thank you for the kind comment. I'm sorry we didn't get to see you to give it to you personally, but I'm glad that you like it anyways. And on that note, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and save it to your favorites. Also, be sure to subscribe to my vlog channel for more of these vlogs, and I'll see you guys next time.